at an Albuquerque elementary school have been sick for days, possibly with a norovirus. Now, school officials sent a letter home to parents today, but one family told Action 7 News reporter Megan Cruz they don't think the school is taking this serious enough. Royal, as you said, that letter was sent home today, but one father says something so serious warrants at least a phone call. Say anything? No. This is like the first time I hear this. You know. This father uh, got the news from Action 7 News that dozens of students at his daughter's school are sick and may have the norovirus. While his five year old is showing no symptoms of the illness, he's still concerned by how this is all being handled. Definitely will, will uh, you know, love to have gone and received a phone call from them saying, hey, you know, we have a possible virus going on. This is the letter parents got from Albuquerque Public Schools explaining the situation at Susie Reyes Marmon Elementary. It says students have been out sick since Wednesday with diarrhea, also vomiting, both symptoms of norovirus. There's no mention of it on the school's website. Did you notice anybody in your class sick today? No. APS says it's working closely with the Department of Health to sanitize the entire school this weekend. There's no mention in that letter that the school will be closed Tuesday. This dad says closed or open, his daughter may not be going to school Tuesday. For us, I was a no. I'm not going to. I'm probably going to go call the school first, see what they say, maybe ask for a nurse to make sure that uh, there's a safe environment there. Uh, you know, for her to go and uh, be safe at their school. Now, other symptoms of norovirus include nausea, stomach cramping, and sometimes a fever and chills. There's no medication for it. School officials recommend a lot of hand washing as it is highly contagious.